click on the subscribe button to watch more videos on my youtube channel to get latest notifications and updates about my videos click on this bell icon Hi friends, welcome to my channel. In this video, I am going to explain the basic tutorials for the beginners. First, after installation of the AutoCAD 2016 software, the icon is on the desktop. I will opening this icon AutoCAD 2016 shortcut file. After opening this uh, on the screen, you observe like this, it is loading. You want required RAM is required for this 2016 software. Minimum 4 GB of RAM is required. If you use 2GB RAM it may slow first know about the AutoCAD uh, AutoCAD is nothing but a computed edit design CAD is nothing but a computed edit design design the models by using these different types of software and using on the computer and installing the software onto the computer and performing the all of the designs as for the client requirements and the, as for the customer requirement this type of softwares are very helpful to design the different types of models in AutoCAD different types of models you can create by using this first this view of the 2016 software is look like this and the acad.dw2 is the file is mostly used on the designing of the softwares are to develop the any of the models in AutoCAD first go on to the AutoCAD on the left side or the small icon on click the icon it dialog box on the box will appear in that new open drawing converter and the required different types of features are available as compared with the previous softwares AutoCAD 2016 is the one of the advanced software to develop the models in the 3d basics and the 3d modeling in advanced also uh, you can create in CAD this is the model you can create the model first go into the new file and go into the desktop you can save in the ACAD select the open on the simply click on the open on the right side it with in parallel and metric two options is there select the metric and most of them use the metric option after you getting the all of the operations like this after you get all the screen like this one of the file will opens you can save the file first First go on to the any of the driving drawing to draw any of the drawing you can save the file on the desktop or any of the documents as your wish I am giving the for example I am giving the file name AutoCAD basics A different types of version you can save the files of type it is showing the lost it is showing on AutoCAD 16 AutoCAD 2 tone drawing at the DWG file and different types of 2010 and 2007 2004 what why these are 2010 are used because if you are using the previous softwares of 2010 or 2012 you can save the software you can save this file on the 2010 format then it opens the file on the 2010 without any errors may form the drawing will opens you can use the 2007 software so previous version you can save the file of file type of 2010 or 2007 uh, so many of them using 2007 to 2012 softwares and 2014 and 2016 present onwards using the advanced softwares and 2017 and 2018 are also available in the market and uh, go on to the AutoCAD file again AutoCAD icon see different you can save the file as a save as drawing also you can default the drawing in the default format you can save the another drawing this file only is save as type in the different name also you can give you can print the files by using the go into the print on that different types of plot bent blatch plot plot preview i will explain this all of the details in my next tutorials first this is the basic introduction to autocad these are the different types of uh, toolbars in the draw and modify in the draw some of the lines and polylines and the modify some of the arrays are there and the annotation can give the any text use the annotation first go on to the op options options op of the command shortcut is options i am giving the op enter you can simply rewrite it to one of the dialog box will appear you can change the all of the features and all of the settings before you perform the any of the drawing in the autocad file these type of 
setting is very helpful op enter then the dialog box will appear nothing but the options first go into the tab files different types of files there there and go into the display you can change the display as light or dark you can change the color you can give the different types of colors on the display tab and open and save already explained you can save the default format in 2013 drawing format you can give the file as 2013 as default as as your wish 2010 and 2010 also you can give like this and this you can mark the all of the object as your wish it simply give like this and the plot and publish nothing but if you want to print you have the printer on the pc you can give the printer i am using the pdf format printer i am giving the pdf version of printer by default you want to change the files and the plot the operations to any of the files you can give this and go on to the system in system different types of displays uh, options are there in the user preference this is the user preference is mostly important before going to the drawing and the window standard behavior in the C the scale is required you want to develop the millimeters object nothing but any all mm you can give the mm size you can give the also in inches and millimeters and different types of units are there you can give the different types of source content units and the drag and draw files both are give the in millimeters what you perform as your wish you can give the all of the dimension you can give the size of the cursors you can give the size in 3d modeling this option this tab is very helpful you can give the z axis you can use the use xyz also you can use any z or different types of formats are available you can view the object in different types of formats 2d wireframe the whole hidden different types of default formats are there and these are the simple dimensions you can give this and these are the tabs are required before going on going on to the drawing and the profile online uh, see these are the tabs are there in the in this type of 2016 software or version and click on apply and click on ok the all the files and the, all the what are the features you created all the files are saved onto the this file and go into the line different types of operations are there and go into the workspace settings this setting is very helpful and go into the workspace settings on the left side of the below bar you can observe then drafting and annotation and 3d basics and the 3d modeling see drafting annotation is nothing but the 2d drawing you develop the 2d drawings drafting annotation is very helpful we want to develop the 3d you can develop the 3d basics and the 3d modeling is helpful for to develop the models in a 3d object for 2d drafting and annotation is required in the c in the top of the uh, different types of tools are there in 3d modeling you can observe the different types of in 3d modeling is advanced to the 3d basics um, the in 2016 so many features are there for the 3d modeling I uh, see different types of uh, sweeps and different types of annotations and the mod face selection toolbar selection planes are there and no filter and different types of I will explain in next tutorials you can give the workspace settings you can change by default you can give the three select by this you can observe on the workspace setting these three and go on to the customize option you can observe the different types of what are the features available in filtering of the process different types of you can observe what are the tools are there in the 3d modeling software also you can observe using the customized toolbar in this toolbar in the below this different types of grid mode is there by using the grid mode use the f7 functional key and the snap mode f9 functional key and go on to the snap f settings go different types of grid snap and the polar snap is there polar snap is useful for the to give the angles different types of angles see snap and grid and the isometric snap and rectangle snap is there and the polar tracking and the object snap and 3d object snap and the object snap is very helpful to intersect the points are there to show the end points please select all the end points and midpoints of the all of the points select all and this also should be in select all positions of the 3d object snap as your wish you can give the 3d object snap and the dynamic input and the quick properties you can observe the quick properties top right directions and the selection cycling is there and click on ok after the uh, snap is completed before to develop the any of the drawing first do these operations it will helpful to uh, to 
give the exact dimensions and uh, different types of models you can create in easy manner easy way and go on to the auto mode already mm, auto is nothing but in a straight line you want to give any of the straight lines auto is very helpful if you draw the line by using the line command l enter i am doing you can also use the on the toolbar also line operation is there i am using the line see the line is not in a straight line before you operate this you can on the we should on the auto is helpful to draw the straight lines without using the any of the keys l enter same as l enter one of the line is there see if you draw like this you can observe the line in a straight position on the screen by using the auto on the functional key of the shortcut of the auto is f8 is the functional key and go into the workspace settings and the drafting annotation you can developing the model in 2d then only i'm giving the drafting annotations and go on to the see simply redirects to the drafting annotation of the 2d is the one of the you can also call it as a one of the workbench and the auto mode and the polar tracking and f10 is the polar tracking see in the polar tracking you can give the different types of angles 5 10 15 20 degrees to 90 180 270 to 360 degrees i will explain in my next tutorials first give the all of the operations before performing the any of the object these are very helpful to for the beginners to learning the autocad see not only in 2016 all type of software is the basic tutorial for the all of the beginners what type for using the any of the autocad software these are the basic to do basic methods and the operations and uh, show i am giving the snapping references lines to object snapping tracking is also there and object snapping o snap f3 already explain o snap o snap enter f3 see you can see the different types of endpoints middle points all can you can all the already give the select all then only i am showing the all of the tick marks on the screen add circles and add scale of the current view is there in the ratio should give the ratio in the one is to one position and the isolate objects is there this feature is very helpful control clean screen control plus o control plus zero you can give the control screen then the tabs and the all of the rooms the drawing only the drawing will observe on the screen without showing all of the toolbars if you go on to the end different types of snap modes are there you can add this onto this tool all below tab also by using the simply selecting the any one with observe on the screen i am updating the transparency of selecting cycle uh, what type of operation you want you can give the i want units like this you want quick properties you can select the quick, quick properties by selecting simply select by the cursor key then it will highlight on the below on below on the command line the command line is very important see in the operation settings the command i am giving the status for example how much you way you create the object you can perform the status or command will helps you uh, what type of lines you taken on before what type of objects you can give by using this the operations all the dimensions will appear on the status command and see different types of features are there i will explain in my tutorials this is the basic introduction of the autocad before performing any of the object simply do the all of the operations first all of the on and some of will off and some of will on